So, if Trump gets impeached, what does that mean for the LGBT community? Are you worried about it? I don't really think that, like, some people think that he's gonna, like, put us to death. And by him, I mean Mike Pence. If you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Mike Pence. But if Trump gets impeached, Mike Pence might take over as, as the president, as the interim president. And, uh, yeah, what does that mean for the LGBT community? It's, it's a tough question to answer, and we don't really know what his intentions are. We know that he supports companies that do conversion therapy, which ends up causing more harm than good, which we've seen throughout history. Um, it doesn't... There's, it's, it's hard to, I don't even want to talk about it. I don't even want to talk about conversion therapy and why it's wrong and why it shouldn't be done. I just want to know what your concerns are with this impeachment. I want the comment section today to be a forum, an open forum. I want you to place your concerns. I want to hear what you guys are concerned about. And I want to address those things in the next video, reading your comments, talking about the things you guys are worried about when it comes to the LGBT community and what this impeachment could mean. Um, things that could happen, they could roll back bills that they've put in order, they could roll back laws, safety laws. There's a lot of concerns when it comes to our safety. And so I just wanted to know what you guys thought about this and what you are worried about. So down in the comments below, please let me know your concerns. And if you have an opinion about this, I would love to hear your opinion. And I'm sure the rest of the people down in the comments would also love to hear your opinion. But I do think that if he is uh, elected interim president, because he is vice president, he will probably put some bills in place or he'll take some bills away or he'll roll back some laws or he'll do as much as he possibly can to affect us and we together cannot let this happen so i'm here to tell you to get out there and go vote your vote matters your voice matters your opinion matters and you should let people hear it and so that's what i want to do in the comments below let's keep this discussion going i will talk to you guys down there and next week i'm going to be reading some of those comments so yeah let's let's make this a good discussion let's have an open discussion and we will we will continue chatting about this, and we'll see what happens. Uh, I made a video like a year and a half ago talking about Trump getting impeached and how that the video was called Trump's Getting Impeached. I ended up deleting that video because I was like, wow, what a ridiculous thing to say and put on the internet. But now he's actually in the process of possibly getting impeached, and it's crazy. So I kind of wish that video was still around. Um, sometimes, sometimes... Personally, I have anxiety and sometimes my anxiety gets the better of me and I'm like, I should probably delete this video. And that's why a lot of my daily vlogs are gone from my channel. That's why a few years ago in 2016, I like basically erased half of my channel. Um, so I'm trying to basically build my channel back up from scratch, which is why, if you've noticed, my views are pretty low. But that's just a part of it and I've accepted it and I know that my audience that has been around that wants to stay around will be here and I know that new people will come on board and they will get behind the message and they will be a part of the family and I want to say thank you if you have been a part of this family for any amount of time a day a year six years ten years however long you've been supporting me I truly appreciate it and I wanted to let you guys know that if you would like to continue supporting me, I actually have a book out right now. It is a photography book about all the abandoned places that I like to explore. It's a, got diary entries in it, and every copy comes signed. So if you guys want to pick up a copy, head to justtheletterk.com slash no tracers and pick up your copy today. But other than that, I just wanted to uh, make this video. It's Friday, it's LGBT day, and we didn't get demonetized last week. So let's keep that up. Let's keep staying monetized. And uh, let's, let's get this channel back up where it needs to be. Thank you, guys. I'll talk to you next week. Stay strong. Keep enduring. Get a book. Cop the merch. Support the channel. You guys are the best. I'll talk to you guys next time. Later. Also, on Instagram, I've been losing like 300 followers every week. And I think it's because they're getting rid of bots and old accounts. So, yeah. I want to know if that's happening to any of you guys as well. Because I've been talking to some friends of mine. And it's also been happening to them. So, it's, uh, it's kind of crazy. But, you know, the algorithm or whatever.